Where is Solis Patterson? Don't ask me, Barry. I just work here. I would have thought you knew all about his after-hours activities. Wouldn't you like to know? Look, I've been up all night writing his bloody speech. He has to deliver it to the world in three and a half minutes. That old bastard doesn't front Australia's international credibility will be down the girdler. Oh, Your Excellency, thank goodness Give me speech, Master. Give me speech. Bless you. Oh, I reckon I have to study this one sitting down. God, do you think he's had a drink? He's already as drunk as a skunk. Well, we've got two minutes to sober him up. What do you got? Some food? Something solid? Uh, yeah. Please, we are very, very, very late, sir. Uh, we do have to no go. No worries. It's, it's very important, sir. No worries. Look at this fiber in this. <laughs> What's the speech about, anyway, pal? Just to try and play it as, as suave and urbane as possible, Celeste. No uh, worries. There are still quite a few people who don't know where Australia is. Gift cheddar. <laughs> Our Rose Maria. I love you. Hello, everybody. <laughs> G'day. Mr. President, ladies and gentlemen of the Assembly, uh, good morning to you. Oh, good afternoon, man. depending on what part of the world you come from. And boy, it's like stepping into the pages of the National Geographic magazine being here today. It's beautiful. <laughs> Mr. President, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Les Patterson. Sir Leslie Colin Patterson, at your service. And I have the honour to be, the, I have the honour to be uh, the Australian ambassador to this wonderful, wonderful organisation. And I, I've had a drink, ladies and gentlemen. I wouldn't be so foolish and hypocritical to suggest to you that I hadn't imbibed. Because I have. I've had a couple of drinks, as a matter of fact, but I've still got control of my faculties. They were still there when I looked at them last, anyway. <laughs> 